Hello and welcome everybody. We're so excited to have all of you here. Um, before we get started, I, I want to have each of you take a moment to think about what is the most difficult um, part of acquiring customers using digital channels. So take a moment to think about that before we get started today. Um, and be sure to use the Q&A uh, section to submit questions to our speakers. So share, share with us, uh, again, what, what the hardest part is of acquiring uh, customers using, using digital channels. So today with me, I, um, we have two great industry leaders that are joining us. And, and really, we want to talk about uh, the customer acquisition journey through digital marketplaces. So our world is actually is changing rapidly with a pandemic looming and so is technology transformation, right? So the digital transformation in the 21st century is led by cloud-based solutions, artificial intelligence and blockchain technologies. In the enterprise ecosystem, the opportunity is 700 billion and one to 2% of that opportunity only one to two percent is made accessible for women tech founders so today we're here to share with you best practices that you can implement starting right now uh, so over to these amazing industry leaders that we have joining us we have christine puccio she is f5's global vp of cloud alliances and market programs she's responsible for leading a team to expand partnerships with cloud providers such as AWS, Microsoft, and Google, their partner ecosystems and GTM programs. She joins F5 through the recent acquisition of NGINX, where she joined in late 2018 from Red Hat as Vice President, Global Strategic Alliance and Partnerships. Uh, she drove increase uh, during her tenure at Red Hat. Christine served as the, dig the Global Senior Director of AWS and Google Cloud and drove increased revenue from Red Hat's cloud computing partners. She also accelerated the growth of Red Hat's global SAP business by closing Red Hat's largest software contract with Red Hat Enterprise Linux and SAP HANA. Christine is a seasoned leader in the uh, technology industry and was previously with companies such as Red Hat, Sun Microsystems, AT&T, and Lockheed Martin. Uh, she has extensive experience with alliances and partnerships and has successfully developed partner strategies and grown robust partner ecosystems that deliver value to both partners and customers. So welcome, Christine. We're delighted to have you here with us today. Um, we also have, we're joined by Sanjay Mehta. He's the Chief Cloud Officer at Tackle.io. He has 25 years of experience. Um, in uh, enterprise software ranging from early stage companies to those opening, um, operating on a global stage. He's, um, as I mentioned, he's the chief cloud officer at Tackle, and he's working to transform the way that enterprise software is procured through more modern digital sales channels. More recently, he, uh, he held executive positions in the US and overseas in sales and leadership and Global Alliances for Trend Micro, where he helped establish Trend as a dominant global force in cloud security. Sanjay is recognized as a leader in digital selling and has a deep understanding of the transformational journey of selling and buying software in cloud marketplaces. Sanjay is a board member for Girls in Tech and an active voice for closing the gender gap in the tech industry. So, Welcome Sanjay and Christine and Sanjay are here with us to share about the power of digital marketplaces and digital sales strategies. So you're in for a treat today as we go through today's session. Again, don't hesitate to share your questions in the chat. We will be sure to get to those at the end of our panel discussion today. I'm Raisa Noel. I'm the Global Events Program Lead of Women in Cloud. And Women in Cloud is a community-led economic development organization to create one billion dollars in economic access for female tech founders for female tech founders 
And um, we're, we're focused on economic development organization. And we, we focus on three areas. First, we focus on female tech entrepreneurship and innovation to foster economic development in the enterprise ecosystem. Second, to build partnership with Fortune brands, entrepreneurs, and communities to create tech employability for women. And third, to drive nonpartisan political advocacy to advance policies that create and retain economic access for women. So that's a little bit about all of us. And to start things off today, I, I wanna get to uh, know both of uh, the presenters joining us today um, so that our audience can get to know you as well. So let's go around and I know I've shared about your, your roles already, um, but you can continue to share a little bit more about yourselves. And I wanna invite you to answer a little icebreaker question to get us started. So that question would be, if you had unlimited time and resources, how would you spend your days? Christine, let's start with you. Hmm. Uh, I think it would be spending more time with my daughter. Um, just little things like just watching her favorite shows. We've been doing that a little bit lately. Um, and then travel. I would love to travel. We, we, we used to do that, <laughs> but we should get back to that sometime soon. <laughs> so. Yes, yes, I, I hear you. I miss airports. Yeah. Um, Sanjay, how about yourself? Yeah, probably similar. And I'd like to think I've been better at it the last few years, but I've been working really hard to try to make EQ and IQ have equal parts in my life and the way I balance it. And uh, I find that there's actually a lot of time if you're just really intentional about how you spend it. So uh, mm -hmm. I used to do that really, really poorly. I think, and, and I'm getting better at it. So I, unlimited time might just create another problem for me. But um, yeah, it's similar, just trying to be present in everything I do and uh, really enjoy those things. And I'd love to get on the road and meet Christine in person one day instead of just doing yeah, well. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes it, it's overdue. We're going to make that happen.